Hey everyone, my name is Serge, and in this tutorial we'll be looking at how to use an awesome preset called Ouroboros to create animated text. Ouroboros essentially allows you to add multiple stroke colors to shape paths, and uh, it was created by this wizard named Sonder, who is working on a project for Google. Let's check out what I was able to make with it, and I'll show you how I did it. Okay, first things first, I'm going to assume that you already have the preset installed. If you do not, check out my description for a link to a video that shows you how to install the preset. Let's begin. You're going to want to create a new composition, call it whatever you want, and uh, search effects and presets for Ouroboros, double click. Now it's going to create a shape layer. Uh, now we're going to make a text layer. And what we're going to do is we need to create a shape layer from the text layer. You're going to want to go to layer, create shapes from text, and uh, we're going to parent the Ouroboros layer to the shapes layer and delete the text layer. So now you can see Ouroboros uh, created an outline based on your shape layer which was based on your text layer. All right, so our word is yo, but Ouroboros only outlined one letter. So to deal with this issue, we're going to go into contents. And then uh, you'll see when you go into contents, groups, and there's only one group, but we have two letters, Y and O. Y is group one, O is group two. So we're going to duplicate group one by pressing control D, and it creates group two. And then we get our outline for O. Now you'll notice that it only created the external outline for O and not the inside circle and creating another group, group 3, doesn't really help. So this can be fixed in Illustrator, but I'm not going to get into that right now. Uh, we can work with this the way it is. So the next step is going to be adding multiple stroke colors to each of the shape paths. So you're going to go into uh, group 1 and then you'll notice it says stroke Ouroboros 1. You're going to press Control D to duplicate it and uh, it's going to create colors uh, based on your Ouroboros preferences. And you're going to do the same thing for group 2. And now both of your letters have multiple stroke colors. Alright, so here comes the fun part. Go to the effect controls panel for Ouroboros and there you'll see you can trim the paths, where the paths start, where they end. Um, play around with that a little bit. Now, uh, making sure we have the Ouroboros layer selected, you're going to head down to Add, select Offset Paths, and then uh, scroll down to Offset Paths 1, and change the amount. So uh, 35 seems like a good number, so let's set it to 35. And now we're going to head over to the Stroke uh, option in the Effect Controls for Ouroboros. We're going to set the width to 6, and we're going to change the line join to round join. Now if you play around with the trim offset option in the uh, effect controls for Ouroboros, you can see a cool effect happening where the circles are circling throughout uh, the text. Now what we're going to do is we're going to want to automate it. So you're going to go into trim offset, and you're going to want to alt click on the stopwatch and type time asterisk 25 and this is going to make it keep playing. Now we're going to scroll up all the way to contents and on the add area we're going to click on that arrow and then we're going to select round corners. We're going to play around with the radius and set it at around 590 and check that out. So this pretty much wraps up the basics of how to use Ouroboros to create really cool animated text. Now, if Ouroboros isn't working for some letters for you, Saunders posted a graphic that shows you how to fix the issue. It involves going to Illustrator, selecting the text, creating outlines, ungrouping, releasing to compound path, and then bringing uh, the path back into After Effects. And then it should work fine. So I hope you've enjoyed this, and I'm going to include the project file. Uh, with this video so you can mess around with it some more see exactly what I did 
So uh, thanks for watching. And uh, remember that the fun really happens in the contents area where you can add trim paths, twists, wiggle paths, wiggle transforms, all that. And uh, when you download the After Effects preset, make sure you donate some well-deserved money to Saunders because he did a really great job with this. So again, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Uh, subscribe and have an awesome time. Bye. You can't keep me in the closet forever. K thanks bye.